Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Idingade. If you're new here and if you're coming back, thanks for tuning in. So today we're going to be doing something totally different. I'm going to show you how to style deras. I'm wearing one, by the way, but uh, it's custom made and uh, well designed. If you want to see more deras, stay tuned till the end, okay? Do not move. Do not stop the video. Do not download it. Just watch it till the end and make sure you share this video to your friends okay so we'll head on straight to the deras and we'll have dera number one this is swahili girl number one and she is from ganjoni her dera is off shoulder with some shuffles around the neck this dera is ideal for weddings you could wear this dera with a pair of sandals and a nice clutch bag Preferably blue or red, just to match with the flowers. So, Hilly Girl number two is from Mikindani. Her dera is very classy, as you can see. You could choose to wear a belt with this dera just to bring out the curves. And also get a head wrap. And you can tie it on your head in just any style you desire. Swahili girl number three is just a girl from Likoni and she's wearing a dera that is a pull neck. Wow, how creative. She has a belt wrapped around her waist. Again, just to bring in the curves. You could wear this pull neck dera with a throw on such as a blazer I picked a white one because of the flowers and you could actually go to many formal events in this outfit wow with a scarf and a throw on this dera could be worn during winter Hence, the Swahili girl from Isli. Our fifth gorgeous and colorful Swahili girl is from Shomoroni. This outfit is very colorful and you can choose to wear it to just any event. It's another off shoulder and you can choose to wear it with or without a belt as it comes with a head wrap for your head. Swahili girl from Old Town wears a baggy dera but with a scarf. She folds it and throws it over her shoulder. And wraps up the look by wearing a belt. Again, just to bring in the curves. This outfit could even be worn to church and many other events. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section below. Just don't forget your pair of heels and your really nice bag as you wear this outfit.
Swahili girl from Nyali decided to make a romper out of her leftover Dera materials. How creative, I know, right? So it's an off-shoulder romper and it could be worn with a pair of sandals or a pair of white patangomas. And you could go to a picnic with this. Creative, right? And our final Swahili girl is from Bamburi Kisauni. This is my favorite outfit as I can use this outfit to travel and go to places with it. It's very comfortable, it's very cozy and it's simple, it's quite... That's it for today. Let me know which one was your favorite, Dera. Let me know who was your favorite Swahili girl. Just comment in the comment section below. Actually, most of these um, Dera designs were inspired by my aunt. I just thought you should know. So you can wear your Deras in different designs. You can go to the tailor and have them tailor made just like mine. If you have noticed, most of my deras are off shoulder and most of them have some bladder going on. So you can always have them tailor made. Life is too short to wear a boring dera. So each time you come to Mombasa or in hot places, just make sure you have your stylish deras with you and you can copy some of the ideas I've shared with you today. That's it for today, guys. Have a blessed day.